Have you ever received a suspicious email asking to click a link to reset your password or a phone call seeking your bank account details? Then it might be a suspected phishing attempt. As more and more users adopt the digital payments route, cyber crimes are also on the rise. One of the common forms of cyber attack where people are increasingly vulnerable is a phishing attack. Phishing is a fraudulent practice where cyber attackers pose as a legitimate entity and communicate via an email or a phone call to gain sensitive and confidential information such as passwords, credit card details, etc. Both individuals and organizations may be vulnerable to phishing attacks and it can target hundreds of victims at any given point of time. Now, how do these attacks work? Typically, there are multiple ways through which phishing attempts are made. Usually, the attacker, who pretends to be from a legitimate organization, sends an email or SMS, which includes a malicious link that redirects the user to a fake website. The fake website is set up in such a way that the user is tricked into giving personal and financial information. Cyber hackers gather the victim's information such as personal interests, work history and other activities for personalized and believable communication. A phishing email could be as simple as this. Now, what do you do to prevent such attacks? Even though phishing attempts have a sophisticated way of communication, we can always pick up some clues and signs by being attentive to the details. For instance, typical phishing attempts have misspelt or suspicious URLs. The email has a sense of urgency and requests you to verify personal information or an SMS that asks for confidential information such as credit card details, bank account details, or other sensitive passwords. Users can also install safety filters into devices and systems such as antivirus software, spam filters, or anti-phishing toolbars. People can also maintain internet hygiene by regularly updating browsers, changing passwords frequently, and blocking unnecessary pop-ups. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views, and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram, and LinkedIn.